Today I will share with you a very quick, simple and tasty dish. It's Argentine Revuelto de Gramajo, my version, for you. Let's start using two nice potatoes. I will peel them and cut them in very, very thin sticks. Great! This is the size that we are looking for, very thin. These beautiful potatoes are called papas pile, which is like a mixture of Spanish and French. Papas would be potatoes and pile would be straw, because they are super thin. The French guy may know what I'm talking about. Now, one step before frying them is to dry them a little bit with a towel or with a sheet so that when we put them in the boiling oil they don't burst. Now let's fry them. Here I have boiling oil. It is very hot. Be careful with this. Super hot. Like hell. Okay, the boiling oil went all the way down to my fire and things become oh, so exciting. This is the exciting thing of cooking. <laughs> okay, leave them cook. It's just a few, a very few minutes because they are super thin. Leave them cook and in the meantime, check them so things don't burn and I will cut some bacon. Over here I'm using bacon, but the Argentine version takes ham. So I'm changing things a little bit. That's the interesting of cooking classics, to change them, to give them your style, your character. Okay, come and check my fries. Please, my potato, my straw potato. We'll leave them fry just a little bit more so that they are super crunchy. Arr! When you have the fry and it, it, it is not soggy. Soggy. So very, very crunchy. We're looking just for that. And in another pan, let's prepare to make the scrambled eggs with the bacon. Bacon into my pan. No oil, just bacon and the pan. Heating pan. Great, we have it crunchy, we have it baconized, baconized, <laughs> and now I will add my scrambled eggs, my eggs first, which will become scrambled, free range eggs. Ah, oh, mamacita! And one more, please, eggy, eggy. Scramble them. We want it to be juicy, babe. So I think it, this is almost ready. Now, let's add the fries. Look how crunchy, how magnificent they are. Add them to your pan. Of course, we are missing salt and pepper, baby. Pepper. Salt. Be careful with the salt, remember your bacon already is salty. And now mix it. Integrate everything. And now follow me. I will remove it from the heat. Don't want the egg to continue cooking, just I want it juicy, eggy. Come here. And now, original Revuelto de Gramajo has beans. But as I'm changing it, I will add some basil. Toast with you. My name is Felicitas Pizarro. Remember, you are what you eat. Today we are Revuelto de Gramajo.